Okay, so we leveled up, uh, because I forgot that you're supposed to sleep. What? Hold on. What's this? Oh. Really? What is that head's weird. Okay, um. Oh. Yeah, we leveled up. Um. That's literally all I did off camera. And I was like, eh, no, whatever. Okay, so I think we got a new quest. So let's check that out. What are we gonna do? Oh, yeah, dude, this is gonna be interesting. From now on, what we're gonna do is. If they're really interesting, or I feel like you guys should be watching me do the Brotherhood quests. And I'll do them off on camera, but if it's just me, like, doing something simple, like, go into this house and stab this guy. Then I'll do it off camera. Or we can do other stuff. Oh god, I thought the lady was, like, glowing red, and I was like, no, thanks. Oh, uh, where are we supposed to go? No. Oh. Okay, so we have to go in this guy's house, but we don't have to kill him. We just gotta talk to him. So, where the hell is it going? Yeah, there were some goblins around here recently. Awful oh creatures. Okay, is this his house? Yeah. Oh, it's a hard door. Why me? Man, I don't know if I have enough lockpick for this. Oh, okay, apparently I just had good enough skill. Okay. Oh! Well, um... Hello. You must be the one I borrowed quite a bit of gold from some underworld types. I, uh, I missed a payment. Now they don't even want the money. They, okay. They've sent an enforcer to kill me. His name... Well... When Hides' heart gets here, I'll put on a little act. You'll cut me with your poison knife, and that vile enforcer will think <coughs> I'm dead. You must then flee from Coral, and Hides' heart must not be killed. That way he can go back and tell his employers I'm dead. If you wait a day, my body will be put on display in the Coral Chapel Undercroft. You can come to me then and administer the antidote. Got all that? Good. Okay. Now is not... Which one? Which knife am I supposed to use? Because I have a couple knives. The the this one. I guess. I mean, that's what it says. It doesn't say anything about it. So I'm gonna save now. Okay. Mokieri, I know you're in there. My employers are most displeased. I'm coming <clears throat> in, and you can beg for your life. <laughs> Not that it will do you any good. <laughs> ah! Ah! <clears throat> you can't get me, you can't get me, and then I can just run away. Oh, dang it, I ran towards them. Can you not know, though? Because then they're gonna come after you and then I'm gonna be sad because then I have to make sure you don't die. Hey, have you heard about Glatz? They say that Pedro came from Oblivion and... No, oh, come on. Every time, every time I mess up my shit. And you just not mess up my shit though. Hopefully it just follows me and then they won't even do anything about it. I can just lead him away. Gotta wait a full 24 hours to get to this asshole. Are we good? Okay, I'm done. I'm done. I mean, as long as nothing crazy happens. And that dude's still dead, we'll be fine. 
I'm listening. Please go oh, ahead. Yeah, murder it. What's new with? Oh. I saw some mud crabs by the water. Nice. Okay, so where the hell is this guy gonna be? Is he gonna be down here? Right, in here, in here. So no. <laughs> I guess we'll find out in a minute. Hello, goodbye, no time to talk. Hello, goodbye, goodbye. Oh, Kiki. Where the hell is this guy? Is he right? Oh, he's right here. Um, oh, I was like, he still looks dead. Oh, I'm a bit stiff, but quite fine otherwise. Which um, leads me to something I may have failed to mention before. My ancestors will see my revival as a desecration of their tomb. This undercroft is, well, quite cursed. I can hear them coming as we speak. Ah, here they Are you kidding me? <laughs> I didn't sign up for this. That's disgusting. Okay, mate, let's go. The real have to go anywhere. Oh, fucking zombie. Move. You just bled. Good lord. Okay, come on, dude. Let's go. Hello, goodbye. Like, for a very important case. Just ignore us, okay. What? We just gotta go over here? I mean... Okay. Is he following me? Okay. Good enough. So we gotta take him here? Am I supposed to like give him over to somebody or what? Ah, the Grey Mare. From here I will be able to arrange for Francois is- <clears throat> Okay. Annoying creature. Yes, we did it. That was fairly simple. Not as um <laughs> fast paced as I thought it was gonna be. Hoping for more more excitement. Okay, we'll start doing something else after I get my reward from this guy, and I'll just take permission, and then we'll get. Or er, actually, no, I'll let you guys. Yeah, I, I won't cut it out yet. Yeah, just in case I get something really good, and then I'm like, oh look, I got it, because I'll forget what I got. <laughs> That's just me. I don't know. Really bad at remembering me. Yeah, but hopefully we can find some good stuff to do after this. So I don't want to sit here and do <laughs> brotherhood missions all over the time, or all the time. I'll probably do like a Oblivion quest or something. I don't know. I do need to get more gold though. Where's this guy at? Hello. Ah, so Mottieri has escaped. Maybe. Well done. As payment, I am pleased to award you this amulet, Cruelty's Heart, as well as another advancement in rank. I hereby bestow upon you the title of Eliminator. Your blood is cold, your heart hard. You exemplify everything the Dark Brotherhood stands for. Get right. I present to you now this key. It unlocks the well behind the abandoned house above. Really? Use it to gain hidden, quick access to this sanctuary. Okay, but I need to talk well, to you. Well, you are an ambitious one, aren't you? Instead, you must report to Ochiva here in the sanctuary. Before you go, however, I intend to make good on an offer I made Ooh. some time ago. As a vampire, I may pass my gift on to others as I see fit. You have served me well, and I choose now to extend that gift to you. Shall I use my dark powers and turn you into a vampire? Yes. Most excellent. Here is what you must do. 
Simply go to sleep here in the sanctuary at any time, and I will visit you as you slumber. I will wrap you in vampirism's dark embrace. You'll never even know I was there. But when you awaken, we will be of the same blood. Once infected with vampirism, you must wait three days and then sleep once more. Then the dark gift will truly take hold. Sleep now and awake anew. Oh, I'm going to regret this, but I'm going to do it anyway. Oh, you don't even know. Okay, I'm going to get my new quest and then I'm going to go to sleep. Ah, greetings. From now on, you will receive all... Yay, contract. In the Imperial City, there lives a high elf who must be removed from existence. I knew you wouldn't be able to resist. Your target is a high elf named Thalian. He lives somewhere in the Imperial City and fancies long walks. Unfortunately, that's all we know. We don't know which district he calls home, which establishments he frequents, or anything about his schedule. This contract will require a bit of detective work. I suggest you speak to your fellow brothers and sisters and see if they can offer any advice. Okay. Ah, yes, there is one more thing. The Imperial City is also home to an Imperial Legion captain named Adamus Philida. Do you know who that is? Um... Quite. Then you know he has dedicated his life to eradicating the Dark Brotherhood and doesn't appreciate when we operate within the Imperial City. Well, thank him the balls. When that happens, he tends to make our lives uncomfortable. Let's not give the good captain any reason to go poking around in our affairs, hmm? If possible, do away with Phalian someplace out of the way, definitely indoors with no other people around, a secure location with no witnesses. This will make it look like a simple murder. Philida will be none the wiser, and you'll receive a nice <laughs> bonus. Now go, and may Sithis go with you. Dang. Okay, so I'm gonna get some quest real quick. Okay, so we'll do that. Um. Oh, I want to do that one. Okay, but now I have to sleep, so I'm gonna just borrow your bed right quick. <clears throat> okay. Then we're gonna wake up and we're gonna feel nice and refreshed. How do we just like share a bed? That's weird. Okay, we're gonna go. Uh, wait, where's that one thing? I can use that one thing now. Um, yeah. And just directly go. Bye! Just let me jump in your argument right quick. Okay, um. Where are we supposed to go? I don't know where this place is that I'm supposed to go. It's just like really far away, I'm gonna be dead. Wood. Um. Where the hell is Castle Anvil? Hold on, wasn't there another one for the Anvil place? Um, hold on. I'm looking. Oh, yeah, I can take that. Okay, so then there's this one. Okay, where the hell is Anvil? <laughs> I don't even know. Um. No.
I'm looking. <laughs> uh, oh, here. I was like, where am I supposed to go? <laughs> That's so confusing. the cave. Splash, splash, I was taking a bath. <clears throat> I'm not sorry. Oh god, game, please. This game, no. I'm gonna give this like to make sure we're good. Okay, um... There's gonna be a lot of crap in here that I'm probably gonna want to take out. Maybe there's nothing in here that I want to take in. Renewed. Also, if you can hear what's going on in the background, I'm sorry. They're chaotic children, I swear. Generally, the younger one gets mad when the other one tries to, um, uh, sleep in there. I don't know why. He's just weird. He's usually more chaotic, uh, when he's sick, which he is currently sick, so. Uh. Anyways. Um, I think we're running crap. I don't know anything of really too much use in here. There's a bug. And we are the blah blah. This is like a I don't even need to do that. Okay, so that's a thieves guild book. With some little Iffy about this fucking place now, because you know. We need the key. Where the hell's the key? Did I miss it? I didn't see a key. Maybe I need to go somewhere else to get a key. Better it's one of these big chests. I'm so sure I'm missing somebody. I'm just looking for a key. Okay. <coughs> no, that's the same way. Okay. Okay, I'm gonna take these. And then I'll take this one now. Because I need to equipped a church. Also can I pretty fix my phone? I don't know how I fix that. Probably something else. Okay. I'm missing something here. I don't know what it is. Is there a key down here? Like <laughs> what am I missing? What's the question? I'm in the cave. Oh, there's more to the cave. Yeah, that looks how much inside these. Only six. Whatever. <clears throat> oh. Seems like. Okay. Holy potatoes. This is huge. A lot bigger than I thought it was gonna be. Although I forgot there's supposed to be like a whole crew and stuff in here. There's two pirate ships. What? About to be me versus a shark ah! and Oh, 
you something. Good lord. I don't know what bone meal does, but I guess I'll take it. What in door to the black flag? Are there any pirates in here? That's surprising. That was me, I was like, what was it? I'm gonna check this whole place before I go anywhere. Okay. Oh, still there's nothing in here. Apparently these pirates do not do good at pirating. I've never just been here so long. Alright. Um, any more skeletons in here? I'm stuck just. I mean, kind of. Hopefully, oh, coming up. Where are all the other fires? And the skeletons. Oh, I can't go that way, to my knowledge. No, oh, there's one here. Take that. They look so angry. I'm probably being locked up here for a couple, like, hundred years or something. At least even a couple years would probably be annoying. <laughs> no, okay, I mean, I guess he said that. <laughs> I think that's all of them except for one of them. But I don't know. Oh, did, is that the one that fell in the water? I don't think so. I'm not sure though. Probably not. I don't know. There's a cave over here. Of course there is. Well, I'm gonna save because I haven't saved in a little bit. Okay. Just gotta make sure I save because I'm really bad at that. I'm really better at remembering to say, where the heck is this guy? Oh, he's right here. <laughs> oh, I'm just going to be in this fucking place there. Hey, rusty door. Hey, there's nothing good in here but rooms. I'm not sure it's water, which I don't know. I'm gonna go on the other pirate ship. I don't think I have any potions. Just unprepared for every mission that I do. Mm, do I wanna go in here? Oh, sorry, came from. Okay. So we're gonna go into pirate ship. He's fun. Oh, is it the same ship then? Oh, fight me. Ow! Yeah! Thank you. Do I have food? Me help. That's not helping me. I need help. I'm full of Daedra hearts. Can I, um, can I create a person for the reason you're by? No, please don't murder me, Captain. There's no Captain. Okay. Oh! What? I can have a pirate ship? Are you kidding me? That's awesome! What? Okay, but I'm really fucking excited for this pirate ship to be mine, though. Like, could you even imagine? I could have a freaking pirate ship. Bruh. 
a pirate ship. Dude, I'm excited. Freaking beyond excited right now. Holy crap. How do I drop stuff? Can I drop stuff? I don't know, I'm just putting random crap on now. Okay, um, is there a thing that I can put stuff in? Just because I don't want this. Okay, I want those because I can sell those. <coughs> I don't want that, I don't want that. Um, I think that's pretty much everything I don't want at this point. Can we make potions? Oh, it's probably gonna be a bunch of stuff that we can like, like, uh, has the same effects and stuff. Yeah, okay. Now I can leave. I can actually have a pirate house. Dude, I'm heck. I'm like super excited about that. Like, you have no idea right now. I'm like, yes, dude, this is great. This is gonna be awesome. I mean, be a pirate captain. I mean, I don't really have to be technically a pirate. I don't have to steal all the beauty. But, you know. Okay, where am I supposed to go? Um... Yes. Where is this? Oh, in town, actually. <clears throat> That's awesome. Um, I'm just gonna say that. Also, there is stuff I have to do here. Oh crap, I just remembered I don't have any money. That's great. That's great. I'm gonna have to do a bunch of, like... Um, Brotherhood quests. From where do you hail? Hold on, let me hit up somebody who's played this game. Cause I need to figure out how to get a shit ton of money for this. What is it now? <laughs> Where the heck? Oh, is I'm supposed to go to the other ship? Okay. And I'm not supposed to talk to you. How do you do? Oh, uh, here. I just got to do a question here. What's your story? Go ahead. Let's do business. How much is everything? Oh my god. God. Oh, one, two, three, four, five. I need like six. You've got to be. I'm sorry. I need like six. Bye. <laughs> I don't even have like a hundred. I don't think. I have sixty-five. Oh, that's awful. Um. I guess for all, while we're here, we can go here, because I think that's right over there, yeah. Okay, so we'll check this out real quick, and I'll see what we, we gotta do anything else. I'm probably gonna have to cut out, like, a good couple minutes of this, but we're gonna have to go. Stop! You violated the- What? That's too- Okay. What did I do here? I didn't do anything here. What? I'm confused. What? What? Ah, damn it. Well, I don't know what I did here. It's my problem. Oh, probably because I just kind of <laughs> arched onto her bone. I don't know if I got in trouble for that or not. That would be my guess. That's the only thing I've done that's questionable. <laughs> Holy crap. I'm just walking, the first thing I see is freaking blood. Okay, did I ever uh, think about, I don't know, 
Jeez. Um, like the Brotherhood. What the fuck? Someone's performing rituals. Why did they have a rake? Why did they have a rake? Why did she have a rake? Somebody's doing rituals. I don't know if it's like... The summon us or what? Like the Brotherhood? But um... Yeah, no, someone's doing rituals. Because her blood is in the thing. Um... Okay. I guess I kinda just gotta go through the whole thing and look. I guess, cause um... I'm not seeing... Oh, I can just open that with my spell. Okay. I'm just coming around to see if there's any more dead bodies. I mean... Hopefully someone's not dead. Oh, I mean, I mean, stuff. I'm just looking through to see if anybody had anything worth freaking taking. Oh, I don't even need that, watch this. I don't know if this is gonna work. I'm taking that. I don't care. Right, now I'm gonna put my health back on. Okay, so nobody really has anything that I'm worried about. Or that they would get killed for, that I'm thinking, but uh. <clears throat> oh god, that's fucking weird. No, thank you. There's dead bodies everywhere. Like me. Maybe somebody commanded the army of the undead. And uh, shoot happen. Okay. I'm not seeing anything that's... That's um, gonna get somebody killed over. But what happened here is my question. I'm thinking maybe something came, came back and it's fucking ghost. Your attack is no attack. Fuck that. Do I have to go through there? How am I supposed to un attack something undead? What? Is there something I'm supposed to get down there? There's something green down there. Okay, so those are things are dead. What am I supposed to... I'm probably gonna die, but I'm trying to just go through and see if I can find something that will get me further on the quest. Because all I'm seeing is freaking ghosts. So what I'm thinking now is somebody just freaking summons ghosts. Why, why do they need ghosts though? That's not wonky or anything. There's tools in the basement. That'll probably kill you. I wouldn't. We have orders to leave everything. It's baffling. <clears throat> Maybe that prophet. What are you looking? <coughs> the smith is next to the north gate. The general trader is in Harborside, outside the wall. Okay. Um. I don't know what to think about the attack. He's that thief that the. He preaches most. I used to think he was crazy, but. Farewell. Okay. So we, I'm pretty sure the cause of death is ghouls in the basement. But um. Uh, find out anything and why. I'm not gonna find anything at 10 p.m. Hopefully, we can get something out of these guys. Green over here. 
here to take this one into his pocket. Well, no. well, well! A wayward son returning to the church. This is only <laughs> the beginning. Umaro <laughs> has returned, as foretold by Pelinal Whitestrake, in his dying breath. Umaru the Unfathered, the Sorcerer King of the Aliens, who ruled over this land for long ages before the rise of men. He was cast down by Pelinal Whitestrake, but Umaru's spirit survived, and now he has returned to seek vengeance upon the gods. Ah. Oh. Does no one remember the old tales? Saint Pelinal, the divine crusader of legend, Alicia's companion when she overthrew the rule of the Aliens 3,000 years ago. Pelinal, with the aid of the gods, fought the alien sorcerer King Umaril and slew him! But. Umaru's spirit survived, and he has now returned. Do you understand? As Uibala, Umarale El Nada Rakuvar. In the alien tongue, by the eternal power of Umaru, the mortal gods shall be cast down. A curse. Upon Umaril's ancient foes, and a threat. Alas, Umaril cannot be stopped. Not without the aid of the gods, not without the Crusaders' relics. Without a champion, the gods are powerless to act. But who among us is worthy to wield the divine Crusaders' weaponry? <coughs> you would quest for the holy panoply of Pelinal White Strike, the legendary relics that have been sought by mighty warriors throughout the ages. Are you a worthy knight? Okay, but I'm gonna stop you right and say, uh, and, uh, say uh, he looks like he is not looking at my eyes. I think he's either looking at my toes or something else. Well then, hail, hero of Kavach! Let me add one more voice to the never-ending chorus of praise. I'm sure one of your many devotees will be able to guide you on your way to find the Crusader's relics. <laughs> the weapons and armor of Pelinal Whitestrake, Alicia's comrade granted to him by the eight divine. He went alone into the White Gold Tower, challenged the alien sorcerer King Umaril to single combat, and slew him! Alas, Umaril was not truly slain, but only cast beyond the bounds of Nern. And now he has returned to wreak his vengeance upon the gods, as was prophesied by Pelinal himself with his dying breath. Only a true knight, wielding the holy relics of the Divine Crusader, has a chance to defeat Umaro. But alas for Tamriel, the Crusader's relics have been lost for many an age. Who now can succeed in the quest for the relics? Where the greatest knights of legend all failed. <laughs> Are you a? No, can you just go back? Uh, just... Why do you come? He is the enemy of all who walk free on Tamriel today. A survivor of the ancient race of alien slave masters who once ruled Cyrodiil. He was struck down by Pelinol, 
but by his art, Umaril had bound himself to the realm of his mistress, the Daedra Lord Meridia. So he was not slain, but simply cast adrift upon the waters of oblivion. Now he has returned to seek vengeance upon the gods who helped bring about his downfall so many ages ago. I have a feeling oblivion to a never ending like thing. What happened here is only the beginning. Look well upon this chapel of Debella! Look at the thing! I did, I talked to him. <clears throat> this is of the dead! So! Are you? Well then, I'm sure one. Okay, but. Are you? Let the gods be the judge. The gods grant insight to those they deem worthy. Why and how they act is not predictable. What I can tell you is that, <clears throat> traditionally, knights who wish to quest for the relics would walk the pilgrim's way. Travel to the way shrines of the nine divines. Pray to each of the gods in turn and ask their favor upon your quest. If the gods deem you worthy, you will be granted a sign. Go forth with the nine's blessings. Okay. May the eight and one guide your steps. No, I can like that. Um, that sounds like so much fun because now I'm literally gonna have to go and find all of these things. Yeah. I don't even know where are. Get to oblivion. Fun. Okay, well that's all the time I have for now. So I hope you guys enjoyed, and maybe next time we'll figure out what we're supposed to do. But until then, I'll see you guys later. Bye!